This is Michelle Knight. This is the astrological update for Aquarius for the whole of January 2014. Now, this January is very, very powerful for you. It starts off in a very mystical way. There's a feeling, you're feeling very intense, you're feeling very sensitive, you're almost feeling telepathic. You feel you can link right in with people and sense what they're thinking and feeling. You've got to be careful though, because there's a part of you that's very unboundaried at the beginning of this month. And you might even feel slightly, thanks to a Cardinal Grand Cross, you might feel slightly isolated from people because you feel that they don't understand you or they're not sensitive enough to you. Now this isn't normally how you are. Make the most of it by grabbing that vital psychic information, but try not to be over sensitive or react to things or become paranoid because the Cardinal Grand Cross is really poking you and testing you to see how secure you are within yourself and how realistic you're being about things in your life at the moment. We also have a grand water triumph which is healing you, making you feel much more confident and secure about your financial future this year. There may have been some financial insecurity or, or a sense of fear connected to the next stage of your life, but you're able to dismiss that and shed that fear thanks to that grand water trine. Now, the good news is Mercury on the 11th is going into your sign. You have the gift of the proverbial gab. Your words are like magic. So use that superpower wisely. People are listening to you. People care about you. You're able to express what you need to express very, very fluidly. We have a full moon also on the 16th, which is making you think, I've got to look after myself now. Maybe you've had a few blurred boundaries, too many adventures, or not really been taking care of yourself on some level. Hunt and sniff out which level needs taken care of and do it. You'll be supported by the universe. This month, as the end of, <coughs> excuse me, this month, the Grand Water Shrine at the end is giving you more healing, as well as a super new moon in your sign on the 30th. Crucially important, make a wish. Know that this is a new beginning, a fresh start. You are reborn in some way and you can go forward taking however you, the best of yourself, taking it forward to the next stage. Have a stunning 2014 and a fabulous January. Take care, I'll speak to you soon.